watched the sheepdog trials last night. Smart dogs. Hey, I had one of them a few years back. Good dog? Best dog I ever had. Where is it now? Shot it. Oh. I had to. Parvo. No, I was going out. This is Sam. This is his house. He got it for free when his nan died. Tonight, he's excited because... Tuesday night's taco night. My name's Mr. Miyagi. I'm Sam's cat. Oh. That bald guy who looks like a pervert is Sam. Oh. <laughs> Sam likes tacos, maybe a bit too much. As you can see, he's a bit weird. It looks his little hands. No one should like tacos that much. A spacious Grado. A spacious Grado. What is this strange magic? He looks like a bald Super Mario brother. But he's a nice enough guy. Apart from the fact that I didn't have a consistent name for three months. Originally, he called me Chan Man Meow. But we both decided that was kind of racist. And so Mr. Meowgi it is. They're all even! They're evenly cubed! He's an idiot. And so Dr. Noodle deserves to play out. It is hot dog fishing season. He's doing his thing again. I love when he does his thing. Monday night is casserole. Oh. Wednesday night, fish fingers. Thursday night, chicken. But Tuesday night is taco night. Oh! Oh, what is wrong with this? Oh my god, it's time to look at this! Oh! You changed the recipe, Dr. Mexico! Why? Why would you do this to us? He didn't hurt you like that! Why did you change the recipe, Dr. Mexico? Why? We got another one. Ah, oh, Frank. A few more paydays like this, we can move to that sock drawer like you've always wanted. Don't tell me what I want, Frank. Yeah, but Violet, this is that ticket out of here. Heard it all before, Frank. Heard it all before. All alone in the wilderness, Dr. Noodles is Dear Dr. Mexico. Until six minutes ago, Dr. Mexico Food Time Taco Kits were my favourite ever food. But that was until they suddenly tasted like total bullshit in my mouth, Dr. Mexico! I mean, I can still remember the first time I tasted your tacos. I was eight years old and full of balding, childlike wonder. It was after playing football one Saturday afternoon with my four best circle friends, Shane Waterson, Ahmed Forstina, Clayton Disley, and some other kid I don't really remember very well. Kids! Come on, dinner's ready! That's my mum, Kay. We were jostling around my kitchen table when suddenly an aroma filled the air. At first I thought it was Clayton. But then Mum came out with something that I can only describe as strange ethnic magic. What is this exotic feast? I thought to myself. At first I thought it looked like bolognese in a biscuit, but it tasted like thunder and lightning in my mouth. It was Dr. Mexico Food Time Tacos. I asked Mum what made them so delicious. She just winked at me and said, I don't know. Dr. Mexico's a specious secreto taco seasoning. A specious secreto, eh? A specious secreto. It was the most enchanting meal of my life. Each taco was more magical than the last. It was like an avalanche of Latino joy in my mouth. After that, I was a Dr. Mexico man for life. But then you went and changed the recipe, Dr. Mexico. And now I'm questioning everything. But mark my words, sir. Uh, I'll get to the bottom of this whole fiasco. I'll work out you're a specious secreto. Yes, I'll work out you're a 
specious credo. Warmest regards, Sam Simmons. P.S. You're a salsa wanker. Meanwhile in Fremantle, Glenn is learning to clap. He's trying his best. <laughs>